if the people with immense power immense social standing are so afraid about doing this how can you expect the common person to raise their voice see i blanket i don't believe in any kind of ban i even with ideas that i don't i disagree with i don't believe anything should be banned when art is black or white it's usually a lie art exists only in that gap i'm a brahmin by birth i mean i know tons and tons and tons of people from the brahmin caste who eat meat including beef so what raw nonsense is this blanket i don't believe in any kind of ban i even with ideas that i don't i disagree with i don't believe anything should be banned or anything should be you know and i i, I think that this also i think the liberal world also has to think about this because we make the same mistake on the other side let's be very clear if you don't like something we say no 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 it should be banned no i think everything should be argued everything should be discussed disagree vehemently fine even fight on twitter fine but there's no question of threatening and banning then we are not a civilized space half the people vishu hindu parishad and the rss or whatever they get a lot of funding from the united states of america where tons and tons of upper caste brahmin nris live what do they think they're eating vegetarian food who are they kidding ask them to stop taking money from any family where meat is eaten please ask them to put a declaration saying that all funders of vishwa hindu parishad and rss henceforth must give a declaration that they are vegetarians please do that and then i will say fine you have a point may you make that point even artists who actually believe uh, that they should toe the line of the government and they probably trust this government that's a choice which is i'm i can live with that but then there is also another set of artists who do this because they are scared that tomorrow when they release that film uh there'll be no gherao of their uh, theaters etc right now i find that problematic if the people with immense power immense social standing are so afraid about doing this how can you expect the common person to raise their voice so when we expect people you know the common person to come on the street and ask for even basic things the fact that a person had to ask for basic rights in this country and we say why shouldn't that person speak the same characters who will put these tweets will talk about how they should fight you are not fighting you have so much power it's okay if you lose 2 crores actually right nothing's going to happen to you you can live with it for that person 10 rupees makes a difference and if you are not willing to make that sacrifice and say so much is at stake so are you then saying if there is more money at stake then you're more timid are you then saying if i have more social standing timidity increases so it's only the poor and the marginalized who should always raise their voice because even if they get killed or hammered or put in jail you and i don't care about it i mean honestly this is ugly it's inhuman so this is selfishness at its best there is always going to be artists with different takes on this uh there are artists who come with agendas and the moment you come with any agenda one thing is you only see one thing you don't see anything else two which means that you may not even believe what you're doing is manipulation you may actually believe that that's the truth right so i'm not going to paint everybody as some evil uh, you know hate mongerer i think some of them are so brainwashed or you're so filled with an agenda that you don't see reality this is also true along with the conniving human beings there are many like this so i think it's important we engage with this conversation with these people so what is it you're not able to see maybe there's something i don't see maybe there is something i don't see i maybe i'm insensitive to something that i don't notice so it's all possible but i think the one thing that every artist can assure or should assure themselves of is honesty integrity 
and willingness to listen. If you can assure yourself as an artist when you make an art object of these three parameters, which means you don't surround yourself with yes people. We can disagree with the art, but the art will have shades of grey, shades we don't comprehend. When art is black or white, it's usually a lie. Art exists only in that gap. 